this is my uh, breakfast for today okay uh, it's a century uh, premium boneless bangus belly or marinated milk fish and then uh, I have there the eggs two eggs and tomato and then uh, I will have either uh, steamed rice or uh, better it's match with the uh, uh, garlic fried rice okay um, it's uh, I think I I uh, get this from uh, SNR and I think this uh, century the century brand is better uh, because I tried the other brand but I think the century is the for me is the best uh, marinated milk fish and there's the rice this is the garlic meal and this light brown okay and then mix the rice and garlic the pepper and and before I hand it to burn that to burn the rice because I don't have much oil anymore it takes a few minutes So this is now my uh, marinated bangus. It's a uh, pork belly, a uh, pork torch. <laughs> it's a bangus belly. I tried to cut it in half, so uh, it will not. Uh, it's very easy for me to fry it. And then uh, I make uh, it the temperature is high, it's 1,000. So uh, the, that will seal the uh, the skin. So all the juice will be stuck inside because if, you, uh, if not then uh, it stretch like it's juicy anywhere. Okay. And then maybe like uh, two, two to three minutes I will uh, um, turn it back sideways uh, and then try the other side of the tamus belly. So now it's cooking the other side the uh, inside part of the bangus belly as you can see the, the back side or the one with the uh, scale is almost brown now and that means uh, yeah, that side is already still so now feeling the other side with the juice of the bangus and the seasoning, seasoning when it was marinated just when it was marinated inside the uh, so though it's deep fried, uh, it's still you can uh, it's still uh, very juicy inside. Okay. In a few uh, minutes, then it's already cooked, and I will have ready my breakfast: bangus with egg, fried rice, garlic fried rice, and tomato, pressed tomato. Okay. As you can see, uh, I have the. Uh, Temperature set to 1000. It's good to have the high setting for the temperature because uh, in the frying, it's a uh, bangus. Uh, I see to it that it's on high temperature. And now, uh, still, you can hear some sound. That means there's still uh, that water uh, in the fridge. 
and that uh, during this period is be careful because um, uh, you, the, the oil will uh, sometimes uh, uh, it will be like uh, it will sparkle or it will uh, go to your skin and you will have burns and but I try to that's why I sometimes I do avoid trying fish, especially milk fish, because I experience having uh, oil uh, gets into my uh, skin, sometimes in the, my, my face, and it hurts. But uh, it's yummy. So just take the necessary precaution uh, when cooking, uh, when frying uh, fish, especially the milk fish. I think it's uh, cooked now and uh, I'm ready to uh, eat my breakfast. Now my uh, breakfast is ready. It's cooked. The fried garlic rice. Just garlic, uh, the rice, uh, salt, and uh, I use a little butter just to salt the garlic. And then as you can see, the fried bangus uh, belly, the marinated bangus belly, see how it, uh, it looks very yummy. It's not that uh, green, but uh, just like uh, brown, so the juice is still sold inside. But, uh, and then as you can see, there is the, the, the other half, I cut it. No? And then I have here the fried egg. Uh, the upside down but I don't like uh, uh, I like a well done egg but it turns out not good because the uh, egg is not that very fresh anymore and then I have here a potato tomato I mean tomato uh, one uh, small tomato but I don't want any dippings because other used to dip that in soy sauce or vinegar with pepper but I prefer eating it with just like that so my breakfast for today okay uh, thank you for watching and come on let's eat now it's a very simple breakfast but it's a Filipino breakfast and we really love eating that uh, fried rice with matching egg and uh, peas sometimes uh, hot dog but I don't like eating hot dog so I prepare the marinated bangus belly bye bye